welcome back to the shop and uh, today I want to show you uh, the way you, you can use an automatic head tapping uh, on a drill press and um, it's a very convenient uh, system that can help uh, for uh, if you have many many uh, tapping operations to make but it could be also dangerous if you do not use uh, the proper way so uh, I will show you uh, on a short video uh, the bad way to use it and, uh, and the good way so let's start with the bad way and uh, the, the thing to know is that uh, uh, you, you, you mount the, the system on a drill press and you have to release the pressure if you don't release the pressure then you will have a break because uh, <clears throat> the pressure um, gives the, the system uh, and inside the head there is a clutch so if you do not uh, release the pressure uh, the clutch will not work so you see the situation the type uh, the tap is broken and now um, the only thing you have to do uh, is to remove the burrs and remove the, the broken type and um, yeah I was uh, in this situation I was using uh, let's say a, a machine gun so um, the next step is to remove the, the broken tap so when you broke uh, when you broke a tool um, you waste some time so that's why it's a uh, critical to understand how to use properly um, the, the, the system and um, <coughs> you have to find the, the range so uh, you can also be uh, upset about the situation so um, so we replace uh, the, the broken tap and uh, release it and now you will see uh, the good way to use the, the automatic tapping head uh, on the tapping head, there is a, uh, a system that can uh, help to set up uh, properly the clutch uh, because the, the bigger the tap you have to do, uh, the higher strength you have to, uh, to put on, on the clutch. So th there is a, uh, a system uh, with a screw that helps to increase or decrease. Uh, the, the, the strength at uh, which the, the clutch will release uh, the head and, and go back. Um, th this system is very interesting because uh, <coughs> in my drill press uh, the machine is not able to, to run in a, a both direction. Uh, my drill press is only able to, to run uh, clockwise. Um, so that's why the automatic tapping head is able to also to reverse um, to reverse uh, the, the operation. So uh it gives a, a good way to uh to find a solution so there is a new tab there um, <clears throat> you have to uh, properly center um the tap with the hole and also uh you have to secure but uh not to tighten uh, the wise put some uh, lubricants and it's uh, very critical and you have to use the good one if, if it is aluminium use aluminum tap or if it is uh, some steel change so in this situation, you, you apply pressure with the drill press and then you release the pressure so the clutch is working and then it go back. And it's the way you have to use properly uh, the automatic tapping head on a, on a drill press. And uh, it's a very convenient system and uh, you're able to make some very, very uh, big quantity uh, of tapping and it's uh, also give a very great result. So I, I want to show with you and I uh, hope uh, it will help uh, some of you. So a, a, next, a next try, release the pressure now. Pressure is released, clutch is open and then the machine go back. And also use the, the slowest speed as possible on, on the machine. <laughs> 